the connection of yin yoga to music is so dear to me and really the foundation of how I've been collaborating with Biff over these last five, six years. And my understanding of the connection or my practice that connects music and the yin and the yin yoga practice is really exploring this aspect of listening. And within the yin practice and the yin trainings, we talk a lot about listening to the body, listening to the stories that are held in the body, and really cultivating space and techniques for that type of listening to the body. And throughout the years that I've practiced yin, I've really always seen a direct connection to the actual practice of listening to sound and listening to music. And beautifully, Biff's trainings integrate these two together. And my experience is really that the it, the process of listening to sound and to music is directly related to the ability to listen to the subtleties of the body, the subtle stories that are held in the body, the subtle messages or energies that are held in the body that are exposed or maybe more present and more alive when we quiet the mind, quiet the breath, and still the body. This listening really invites the entire body in the yin practice to become a listening tool, not just the eardrums, but the skin, the feet, the heart, the bones become part of our listening instrument. And this this ability that music can really access our emotional experience in a way that doesn't necessarily use words, again, instrumental music mostly, allows this beautiful space to connect emotionally to the sound and to our own stories and it evokes our memories and, and the emotionality that is constantly within coursing through our experience. The music is a guide to that. It's sonically connecting to the present moment. It really invites a presence and it is a guide to that journey of the in practice of, of any type of meditative practice. Music really deepens that group experience. Music in the trainings has really pointed directly to that question of how do we cultivate listening using sound, using stillness, using silence, using different shapes of the body, feeling into the breath. These are different techniques that cultivate that listening and use the whole body as a listening instrument and, and rides music as a sonic presence that really can deepen not just the yin practice, but our group community of learning in these yin trainings.